Hello guys, now in this particular video, we will be learning about the how we can pass the parameters while running our script, okay? So let's start with this video, okay? So I have already opened up my VS Code and you can also open it using the terminal or from here, from applications also. So right now, we'll create a new file that is uh, uh, arguments.sh, okay? I will write the hash bank or shebang, you can say, whatever you want, uh, sorry bin bash okay now here uh, what we will do uh, i will run this script and i will pass some arguments and parameters and we will use those parameters and do some manipulation in those things okay so before the starting the video let me tell you first thing like suppose i run this script uh, this one command substitution or maybe see which uh, script i have run oh yeah suppose this command substitution is one of the script so here I will pass some parameters like I will pass my name, my number, okay, and my some uh, something like uh, country, India. So in these uh, in these way we can pass the parameters, okay. And how we will access these parameters? So you can access these parameters using like this, like uh, using echo dollar one okay dollar one for the first parameter echo dollar two for the second parameter echo dollar three for the third parameter so here you can access till dollar nine and dollar zero is reserved and it gives you the name of your script okay so this is the uh, in this way you can uh, uh, work with the parameters and now what we have to do, uh, we will just uh, save this file and what we will do, we will just run this particular script. I will just give the permissions to this chmod plus x and 05 fragments.sh and I will clear the screen and I will just run those script 05 okay done and now what I will do, I will just pass some params like right now I want to pass my name Ayush okay i will pass my country india i will pass my number uh okay and then i will pass something uh like uh, shell tutorial i can write like this okay so when i will hit enter then you will see what happens so here you can see first uh, line giving me the name of the script second line the uh, second first parameter then third is the second parameter then my number and we are not getting the cell tutorial why because we have not used dollar four okay so we will use here equal dollar four and again i will run the same script okay now here you can see all the uh what we can say arguments we have got in these form okay so you have to also remember one thing here like if i am going to just uh, uh, pass the one parameter then in this case the other will be ignored okay so as you can see others have been ignored that is nothing okay and if you want to give the like, uh, like this suppose uh, i want to find my want my full name like ayush kumar so if I will do this, so now it will act like this will be act as a first parameter, this will be act as second parameter. So to act like to use this as a one parameter, you can use this. Uh, okay, so now you will get this. Okay, output. Okay, so I hope you got it how you can uh, work with the parameters. And now moving forward, uh, if you want to get the uh, list of all the parameters you pass, so there are the some special uh, characters or yeah, you can say characters. So how will you use to print all the arguments? We will use dollar at the date. And now it will print all the arguments which you will pass. So what I will do, I will run this script, this one. And here you can see I have got the all the arguments which we have passed, like I use India number and cell tutorial. Okay. And also there is one more like uh, eco dollar hash to get uh, how many number of parameters we have passed. Not this one dollar okay so again just to clear the screen and I will run this script and here we can see we have passed the four parameters yeah that's true okay now what we can do we can also store the value of these uh, 
parameters which were passed in a variable suppose i want to store like name equal to dollar one and i will just remove this not i will do i will just keep it up okay and then i will try to access my name so here i can give my name is like this we can do also dollar name okay save this and now i will just clear the screen and i will run this and here you can see my name which i use so you can store the uh, whatever the arguments you have passed in a variable also so in this way you can pass the parameter pass the value okay so i hope you liked it guys and i hope you understood it if you have any query you can ask in the comment section and also here you can see uh, i have updated this uh, repository and i will give the link of this particular repository you can access this like from here like github.com i use 098 hub and this one cell scripting tutorial okay from here you can get the whatever we are writing the course like you, you will get each and every source course there okay so that's all for today's guide i hope you liked it and i will meet you in the next video so thank you thank you guys for watching bye bye